Yo, 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 it's your boy DC. What up? How y'all doing out there? It's another Sherlock Holmes Devil Daughter video. If you've been waiting for this, sorry for the wait. If you haven't, check out the series. It's fire! If you're into this kind of game, this is a, a like a mystery, you know, thriller game. It's kind of cool. It's kind of fun. I'm a big fan of Sherlock Holmes, so this is something that I highly enjoy. Um, so if you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe to the vid. Check out the other videos. Share for yeah boy, and uh, you know, enjoy. We'll get right back into it. Holmes, you simply have to face up to it. You need to have a serious discussion with Kate about her origin. No, the I fudge, I don't. No more excuses. Don't be in my ear, Watson. You've been gone. I've been dealing with some dude that's trying to be like this me. Other hidden secret. She will not forgive you. She does not need to know why. No. So she will blame you for Alice's departure. Is that what you want? I don't no. care. I certainly. It's as Kate said. I, I always do the wrong thing where she's concerned. Now look uh, here. This, I I'll touch. Get your hand off my shoulder. Once we're back at Baker's. Oh, Gabby, why goodness. have we stopped? The road to the square is blocked, sir. The road to the square is blocked. There's been a bad road accident. There's been a bad road accident. What is it? Oh, my God. Good God on my head. We'd better hurry. There may be injured who need help. Come on. Look at the electricity. On the ground. Come up. His pupils are constricted, but they are moving. He is He's alive. been shocked. He's in shock. He has stopped breathing. There's no heartbeat. I must act quickly to save him. Oh, I, I'm Watson? Okay. Oh, what? CPR Dance Dance Revolution. Here we go. Dude dead. Maybe I right. I missed a few. Thank goodness. This man will live. No the hell you it ain't coffee and do nothing. Oh my goodness. Oops. Don't just stand there. Do something. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do right here? Please move to a safer area, sir. Woo! That was quick. I told you move to a safer area. And you ain't want to listen to me. Don't worry. I'm okay. I probably should go to the closer people. Oh, snap. It's... There are no wounds or injuries. I'd better call for Watson. Watson can handle that. Perhaps Holmes will find a way to free this bomb man. Still going the wrong way. I need help. I don't care if you need help. Oh snap! Oh snap! Somebody! Give me a second! Give me a second! About to do some dance dance revolution! I see no visible injuries. Perhaps I could use a moment. Wake him up! Oh! My head! Oh my head! Watson, I mean, uh, I'm supposed to do, uh, no visible wounds, not injured. Underneath the front of Traplet. It's pretty freaking obvious, Holmes. What? 
Heavy weight. Oh. One plank could be used as a lever. I'm finished complete. Get him in there. Get him. Yeah. 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 Leg bleeding. Under her body. Scaffolding. Handsaw. Couldn't cut the scaffolding. Where's it? Find your hands. Oh no! Oh no! Get the saw on. Y'all hear them cracking noises? Me actually sawing. Got a saw, saw, saw. Porn. I need help. I listen. I'm helping as many people as I can. Okay. The rest of y'all. Thanks for your help. Ah. Oh, my shoulder. I'd better call for Watson. I'm not calling for nobody. Can I go in here? Watson. I need help. Shut up. Please help me. My leg. My name is Dr. Watson. Let me examine. I don't have to introduce myself. Just help the poor man. My name is Dr. Watson. No bones appear to be broken. Ah, it hurts. There's some extreme bruising. It's not like I this think fell. an improvised bandage will do for now. One moment, and I'll fetch what I need. What the fudge? I gotta go fetch it? Now, let me okay. apply the bandage. Jesus Christ. I need something else besides rope. No, no. Uh, put that down. I'm guessing I need the plank. Thank you, Doctor. That's not a bandage. You gotta be kidding me. You're like, oh, there's apply the bandage. Oh, shoulder. I'm a doctor. Will you allow me to look at your shoulder? Oh, God. Oh, my God. Ouch. Oh, he dislocated his shoulder. Thank you for your help. Oh, thank goodness. We were able to help everybody. Yippee! Oh. Well, we were able to help everybody. That was a good job. Good job, Watson. Holmes. It appears the police have arrested someone. Perhaps it is the person responsible for this disaster. Most likely not. It's just somebody who's in the area. It's gonna look weird that we are here. Let me go. You're talking nonsense. Insulting a police constable, eh? That's quite enough. What's happening here, constable? Mr. Holmes, this gentleman here is the fellow who built the scaffolding which collapsed and caused this accident. That ain't true. How are you hurt? This hammer hit me on the leg. How? Oh. It flew out from the scaffolding I put up. When the damn thing collapsed, the hammer flew out and coshed me leg. You were standing over there at the time. Oh, I. Yeah, that's right. So it would not have been possible for him to bring the scaffolding down, Constable? Perhaps it was poorly constructed. Oh, right. Oh, yes, on purpose, though? And what made it fall? Perhaps it was you 
waving around that rotten stick of yours. You'll wind up getting a taste of it if you carry on like this. One moment, Constable. See, the scaffolding no, here has been no entirely like dislodged. It is unlikely that this disaster could have been the fault of this gentleman. Allow me to inspect the area. And if you could possibly be of use, close off the surrounding section. Do not grant anyone access, nor allow them to leave. Is that quite clear? Absolutely, Mr. Holmes. Hey, I'm a boss. This accident hey, is a little unusual. I'm a boss. I need to concentrate on the details. I'm a boss. I must include all the participants in the accident sequence. What am I supposed to be clicking on? Uh My poor leg. I don't know what I'm supposed to do, but we're going to try to find out. Might I ask you some questions regarding the accident? Please. Not now. I'm in shock. All right, so this carriage was struck by the scaffold when it fell. Okay, I gotta find out what things are were. Dang! I go around, or else I'm gonna get shocked by this. This technical cab was involved in this tragic accident. Technical cab. The old gas lamps in this square have been upgraded to electricity. A puddle of water and electricity. A deadly combination. Let's see, what's in here? Okay. Are there really batteries in the lamppost? That's it. Holy moly donut shop. Those wardrobes fell like dominoes. This jaunting car would be capable of traveling at great speed. The driver is dead. He was killed by the explosion. This cab was set on fire by the explosion at the lamp shop. My say it all happened so quickly. There was an explosion and my all startled and threw me back against those wardrobes. The pumpkins fell here after the sprung cart collided. This mechanism played a part of the accident, I'm sure of it. That hit it. And what? So there were five things, so. Pumpkin hit that. Hit that. Hit that. Hit the counterweight. Right, so what's up? That's it. Hey! Did it on the first shot. Hey! Ah, goodness. Run around. A common phaeton. An uncommon location. Jesus Christ. This horse was blinded by the flag, causing it to bolt into the window. The overturned lamps may well have caused the fire and explosion. 
celebratory bunting. A dead driver, another victim of the explosion. Mm -hmm. Celebratory bunting. I think I walked around the entire map. Might I ask you some questions regarding the accident? No, you can't. Go away. All right. Might I ask? No, you can't. Go away. And then I punch you in the fucking face. You like, oh, he was so mean. He hit me. This cab hit the scaffold and caused it to fall. It's eleven. The rope holding the bunting was torn apart. A large section of it is now missing. The axe was catapulted by the scaffold and it landed here. That's it. I mean, that's not it, but... My poor leg. figure this out I can't can I look up look up Marlin say cheese Got the, the bad John bad John an old sprung cart which has seen better days damn it I thought I had it Oh. Good day to you, sir. Would you mind answering some questions? I'm investigating this accident. Are you the driver of this cart? Yeah. I was transporting vegetables from my farm to the London market. What can you tell me about the accident? Oh, I don't know. There was a collision. I felt the ground. I come over all dizzy. What, what did you collide with? with? Um, that contraption up in front of me. He stopped all of a sudden, and I tried to avoid him, but I wasn't quick enough. I wonder. Do you have any idea what might have caused this cab to stop so sharply? No, no idea. And there we have it. I believe I've enough information about this accident. Now let's recreate the sequence of things. Oh my god. Let us see. All right, so the dude said the dude stop. So this has to be one. That happened. Then, so it would have had to be him. He spun out. And then that would have had to happen. And this, so that got chopped. Then it would have hit him. And most likely it hit him as well. And that would have fell. And because of that, I think that would have exploded. He probably fell over after the, the thing. Because you think about the bombs going on. And that happened. Then that happened, for sure. And then this had to happen. Oh, okay. oh well. And then this That's it. Hey! The technical cab's sudden halt caused this disaster, but the lamppost fell down afterwards. So why did the cab stop? So we gotta find out why Boar stopped 
so sudden. What a bloody carnage! I'm about to say, maybe he's dead. Tattoo. tattoo. Maybe he was dead beforehand. I suspect it's from a gap. Palm this man was killed by electricity, as shown by the distinct mark on his hand. Oh, he has a gun. This man was armed with a revolver. Webley, I suspect. Dirt on boots. He had to be dead beforehand. There's a metal strap in. Oh, oh, thanks. This crank has been turned. Oh, somebody turned the crank. There's a person in the back. He also has a dog tattoo. It's a gang of dirty mongrels. Electrical burns from him too. So what the fudge is everybody doing? Just touching stuff? Licorice? Please. Legs broken for sure. Uh er. Are we going on the other side? Okay. Tattoo on the hand. Rasco. Yes, I know him. He's a small time local criminal. What's this? Some kind of solvent. A piece right. of fabric drenched in solvent. So what does that mean? Mud. Oof. Smells bad. A pneumatic hammer. I don't a pneumatic hammer. So like Okay. Uh what where's Watson at? My dude. Oh, his head's banging. My poor leg. What do you make of this accident, Holmes? I'm trying to find somebody to help me. Mr. Holmes? Oh my gosh. Might I ask you some questions regarding the accident? It all happened so quickly. Okay. Uh, I don't quite know what to do now. Oh, what's this? Hold up. There is some text underneath the paint here. This cab was painted recently. Could be important. I'll need to find a way to remove this fresh paint. So I gotta. F I don't wanna wait for our lives to be over. Gotta find a move, fresh way to move that paint. This is like. Dead man. Oh, solvent. I can use the solvent. No. I can use the solvent and move the paint that way. Let me get this. Hey. Underground Electric Railways Company of London. Okay. Now we're getting somewhere. And if you hear something in the background, that is indeed an air conditioner. It is hot in Philly. And yeah. Yeah, it's just it's just it's just hot. So sorry.
There is some electrical wiring here beneath the manhole. Mm -hmm. Someone set up a trap. It's a trap. It's a trap. It's a trap. It's a... It's a trap. Oh my god. A double lock can be used in the same way as two single ones. Oh, you... What? Oh my goodness. So... I just need a twofer. Ah. Uh, what? A four and two? Okay. There's no space for this lockpick. Okay, that worked. That was weird. Well, now. I've not seen such a device before. Clever. Set up. What the fudge? The electrical charge which affected the technical cab came from here. Oh, wow. So somebody s set it up. This is getting good. I can see the technical cab very well from here. This is the ambush. This was an ambush. What the hell is it? Hey! Hey, yo, dog! Holmes, I was looking for you. I have an idea about the accident. Never mind. This one is murder. What? What? You? You're a murderer, You're right? off your head. Are you sure, Holmes? Oh, yes. A murder and an accident, because the killer, by electrocuting the cab, created this chaos. And so this multiple crash is now our great chance. Our great chance? Of what, of what Holmes? Holmes? The culprit could not have planned for this to happen, don't you see? And it is possible that he is still here due to the prompt arrival of the police. Now I see five men who could be our murderer. Let us take a look at the map. Hmm.
Oh wow. Who else could it be? There's no one else alive. Everyone else is dead. Find this. I right, checked him. Uh, there's no one else alive. Three or five suspects have been found. He's the Is there anyone else that's... And that was our cabbie. <laughs> Time to think. That's it. Got it. Because people were driving didn't have, you know, an idea. Constable, I suspect three people here. Take them to Scotland Yard for questioning. As long as I don't leave empty handed, all's good and well. I know that look, Holmes. Have you found something new? That's right. In order to trap the cab, the killer must have known the precise route it would take. The precise route! Or even, that could suggest the cab must have set out not far from here, in this very street, perhaps. Remarkable. Holmes, I'm terribly sorry, but I must go to the hospital now to help tend to the wounded. I understand, Watson. You're always dipping out of me, you little our earlier discussion. Hmm? About Kate. Ah! Uh, Kate can wait. Ha <laughs> ha! Alright y'all, so I'm going to end this right here, uh, please like and subscribe, uh, when we come back we'll continue more of Sherlock Holmes, this has been another great video, I'm your boy Mr. DC, and I'm out this joint.